I do. I have like there are a few people who I I know of like reviewers or something, and they'll mention uh, was it Mr. Robot? Yeah. Um, or will use footage from it, and they'll use it for a lot of different purposes. Yeah. But what I'm getting is at least worth a watch. It's yeah, interesting. I will, I will say rewatching it though is. Because, see, and I think it used to be my favorite. I think that it's not my favorite show anymore. I don't know, I have to finish my rewatch of it. Um, but one thing I'm realizing is season one was way worse than all the rest of the seasons. And so one thing I liked about the show is that it has some very meticulous storytelling. But I think some of their storytelling got a little bit lazy. Well, it was, wasn't lazy, it just wasn't as meticulous as, uh, like, in season one as it was in later seasons that's like a little bit disappointing because like i'm like i just finished season one i'm at like season two episode three now and like watching the seasons back to back it's like man this season is so much better than the last season Hmm. and like especially like like visually too like there's more like definitive and um deliberate use of color in mr robot which granted season two didn't really have a definitive color like other than like gray but still, each scene kind of has its own definitive color, like certain, like, episodes, like, or certain scenes, like, there's mostly, like, red in the scene, and then that looks kind of nice. Some scenes, like, mostly, like, orange with blue hues in the corner, and, like, that looks kind of nice. It's not till you get to season three, where, like, the predominant color is, like, blue, and then season four, like, the predominant color is kind of, like, light blue at the beginning, but then it, it descends into red towards the end. 